Remember, when we differentiate y, the derivative is dy by dx. So, by the fundamental rule, when we integrate dy by dx, we get the y back again. Similarly, when we differentiate f of x, the derivative is f prime x. And by the fundamental rule, when we integrate it, we get the fx back again. So, when you have an equation that has dy by dx from the beginning, and you have to find the expression for y, so what we have to do is we have to integrate it by the fundamental rule. So, y equals to integration of dy by dx, which is 2x cubed plus 1. So, when we integrate this, we get 2 x to the power 4 by 4 plus 1 becomes x and plus c for indefinite integral. And this turns out to be half x to the power 4 plus x plus c. Now, in the next example, we have f prime x. That is another derivative. So, if we have to find f of x, we have to again use the fundamental rule. So, f of x equals to integration of f prime x. That turns out to be 6 minus 4x minus 3x squared dx. So, this is 6x minus 4x squared by 2 minus 3x cubed by 3 plus c. So, this turns out to be 6x minus 2x squared minus x cubed plus c. Since we have a plus c, the unknown constant, we call that solution the general solution of the differential equation.